everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Chris, Chris Han. I review fashion, beauty, and lifestyle products on this channel. So if you're anything like me, you've probably been on a hunt for an effective way to manage your hair removal routine without constantly going to the salon. That's where you like Air 3, this IPL hair removal device has been such a lifesaver for me. I've been using it for over two years now. Honestly, it's been a staple in my hair removal routine. But then you like came out with the all new Air 10. I just got curious. What's new and is it really worth it? I finally got my hands on it. I've been using it for about four weeks now. So today I'm gonna share my experience with both devices. You like Air 10 versus you like Air 3. And I'll walk you through some hands-on demos to show you how these two devices actually perform in real life. Let's start with the basics. The one of the first things that I noticed about you like Air 10 is the treatment window size. Let's take a closer look. The treatment window of you like Air 10 is slightly larger of the one with you like Air 3. That's because you like Air 10 has dual lights, which increases the treatment area by 18%. And I did a little experiment to see how this plays out in real life. I timed myself treating one forearm with each device. The you like Air 10 took less than two minutes, while the Ulike Air 3 took closer to two minutes and 15 seconds. To be honest, it's not like a huge difference if you're treating like smaller areas like your facial hair, armpits, things like that. But if you're working on larger areas like your legs, your arms, this is definitely a time saver. According to the brand, the new model Air 10 with dual lights has a 57% higher energy output and the flash speed is 280% faster. So the dual lights, this new upgrade is really like impressive. It just makes the whole device a lot more efficient and more powerful. Now let's talk modes. Air 3 has three different modes that cover the basics. It's been always like reliable for me. But the Air 10 incorporates a new feature, the SHR mode. And here's where the things get interesting. SHR mode delivers 26 joule of energy, which is a lot more powerful than the standard modes. To see how it performs, I've been focusing on my legs, which tend to have more stubborn hair. And I documented my progress in the past weeks. You can definitely see the difference. The Air 10's SHR mode worked faster in like the regrowth reduction, especially on those hard to treat areas. One thing I love about both devices, I would say, and all you like IPL hair removal devices, is the advanced Sapphire ice cooling technology. It's one of the first ice cooling technology that really worked for my skin. It gives the cooling effect, it keeps the skin pretty comfortable during the whole treatment even on the most sensitive areas like bikini lines. To test this out, this time I used a thermometer to check the surface temperatures when both devices are running. I would say both devices stay cool and nice, and the surface temperature of Air 10 is slightly lower than the one with Air 3. From my experience, the cooling systems of both models work pretty nicely for my skin. They both protect the skin, no burning sensation, no tingling feeling, and I like both. But you like Air 10, just feels slightly more refreshing. I think because it has an upgraded cooling system. And the cooling area of you like Air 10 is slightly larger than the Air 3's. And if you're new to the ice cooling technology, you wanna check this out. See how the window fogs up during use. That's how the cooling system is working to keep your skin safe from irritation or burning sensation. And a little detail like this makes a big difference. Just so you know that you like Air 10 uses patent chips to guarantee that these um, advanced technologies like SHR mode can work in real life. They can take effect in real life thanks to the advanced chips. And another new feature of you like Air 10 that I've been appreciating is the skin sensor. It's like the skin safe detection sensor. This feature adjusts the energy level automatically based on the skin tone. So you're always using it safely. Just for fun, I tried out on my own skin and this kiwi. Can you see that? It stops working on this kiwi. It's like a nice reassurance that this device won't work unless it's safe to do so. 
Speaking of safety, you like Air 10 also has this UV protection. It filters any harmful lights to avoid any potential like skin damage during the treatment. By the way, IPL is not really recommended for like really deep skin tones or tattooed skin. You want to refer to this chart to see if you can safely use IPL. And for demonstration, I did a little bit fake tattoo on my skin with my daughter's color markers. And you can see how you like air tan can safely skip these areas. And for this video, I did a little bit of research and I checked ULIKE's website. I saw some of the doctor's recommendations here. ULIKE devices have been endorsed by a lot of experts and doctors. It's like additional peace of mind for everyday user just like myself. So here's what I've landed after four weeks of testing. The Air 3 is still a fantastic choice if you're looking for something that's simple, effective, and straightforward. But if you're dealing with very thick, very stubborn hair, or if you're looking for faster results, Air 10 is definitely worth trying. It is a better, faster, like upgraded version of Air 3. All the new features make Air 10 stand out, including the larger treatment area, using dual light, the SHR mode, improved the cooling, and improved the safety measures. Since it's Black Friday, it's the perfect time for you to try it out. You like is offering $130 off using my code Chris130. The link is in the description, you can go from there. And this is the discount page. If you don't use the code, you only get $80 off. If you use my code, you get $130 off, which is additional $50. No matter which device you end up getting, I hope this video helps you make an informed decision. Let me know what you think about these devices. You can leave a comment in the comment section. If you have any questions, you can also use the comment section. And I'd like to hear your thoughts. So that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel if you haven't. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.